My name is Leonard Augustine Chu, and I am the costume designer for SRT's Gretel and Hansel. Dan was very lovely and open to finding a visual story that we both liked. He gave me a few key words to start off. Fun, friendly, youthful, energetic, cat in the hat, famous five, English countryside. We decided to base our silhouettes kind of in the 1930s and 1940s. And from there, I began a process of making the design my own. I go off and do my own research. Uh, I look into old photographs. I look into old sewing patterns, uh, magazines that sell clothing, and even historical research. I wanted to create a playful fantasy fairy tale. So I looked actually at children's illustrators like Arthur Rackham, like John Tenniel, like Quentin Blake. And I wanted the costumes to be almost like a children's storybook come to life. From there I decide what kind of silhouette I want. Based on real period silhouettes, they have real elements like the period shoes, like the bloomers, like the petticoat, and the period shapes and textures. And then I go out and find different kinds of fabric and ready-made pieces. And based on what I find, I build a color story. I didn't want to put Gretel in pink and Hansel in blue. So there are a lot of earth tones that are mixed in with pastels. I definitely wanted our costumes to be something really fun to look at for both adults and children. I wanted them to move very excitingly. So they have multiple layers and when they're moving on stage you might get a peekaboo of a different colour or a different texture. So if you look at Hansel's sweater vest, there are little sheep on them, there are little bugles. Gretel has a lot of bows, little roses, little flower buttons. These little, little elements were very fun to find, to put on the costume and design, and then also very fun to just watch move on stage.